I'm here with the one and only Santa. How are you today? I am wonderful. Thank you very much. How are you feeling? This is such I'm an amazing event. Great. This is the 88th annual Hollywood Christmas Parade. And we are going to have a fantastic evening. We've got hundreds of thousands of children along the parade route waiting to see my float and the reindeer come down the boulevard. And of course, we have lots of stars and celebrities tonight, too. We're here with the amazing one and only Sean Waynes. How are you today? I'm good. How are you doing, love? I'm doing great. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Happy holidays. Happy holidays. How Happy do you feel? Holiday. How do you feel being here today? Oh, I feel great. I'm excited. I'm a big kid. I'm here to uh, celebrate the 88th annual Hollywood Christmas Parade. I'm here with the Boo Crew, representing the Boo Crew. Hi, guys. Tell us a little bit about you. So I'm the uh, construction guy. I'm the one that oversees the construction. This is the incomparable Jennifer Bertrand, the amazing designer that makes everything wow. beautiful. This is Art Edmonds over here. Oh, hey! Oh, you're like, right right who's here? this guy standing behind you? Oh my God. Yes, and of course, he Lacey Evans, WWE Super. Hello, hello. Thank you for having us. John Lindstrom from General Hospital. Lindstrom. Lindstrom. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> okay, that's okay. It's an old person. <laughs> <laughs> well, I know you always have some great projects going on. Mm -hmm. Tell us a little bit about something new you have coming. Uh, so right now, uh, coming up, I have an end of the year special on the CW with James Maslow for Pop Stars Best of 2019. And so we count down the best stuff that happened this year, and it's really fun. I love James Maslow. Uh, we had the big stage show together, and so it's going to be fun to do this together as well. Willie Ames. Jennifer Runyon. Josie Davis. Scott Baio. Awesome. How are you guys enjoying the event so far? So far, we're having a great time. Hi, we're here with the beautiful Jennifer. How are you today? I'm good. How are you doing? Hey, how do you feel being here today? You know, I'm really happy. It's a wonderful cause, and the CW was so kind to invite everyone down here. And yeah, it's an infectious sort of holiday, just happiness you don't get a lot of in, a, in Hollywood. <laughs> Tell us a little bit about the Boo Crew. The Boo Crew is a, a series of animated specials and children's books that me and my brothers created that um, teach kids life lessons through humor and music. The concept is if you was to take Charlie Brown and Fat Albert and put a hip hop twist to it, that would be the Boo Crew. David, how are you today? Doing great, Danny. You enjoying yourself so far? I am. It's it's cold, but we're still like all happy and excited Yay. for Christmas. It's the holidays, and this is an amazing event. Is this your first time? This is actually my second time. I came last year, for, and it was a lot of fun, so I'm glad to be back. Uh, right now, I'm shooting some General Hospital. I play those crazy twins, Kevin Collins and, and Ryan Chamberlain. Good twin, bad twin. It's a lot of work. Um, and I have a couple of movies coming out. One's called A Dark Foe with Selma Blair and Graham Greene. It's a horror film in which I play a very, very bad man. And uh, a spy thriller called Marzipan that I did with Tamara Taylor and Reese Noy. That'll be coming out later in 2020. Hi, Way. How are you doing today? Good, how are you? Great. Tell us a little bit about yourself. So um, I'm actually on a TV show called Young Sheldon. And it's basically a spin-off of The Big Bang Theory when one of the main characters is little. And I play his friend slash bully. I love that show. Oh, thank you. <laughs> so I am a Navy veteran turned private investigator who hosts a show on the CW called Mysteries Decoded. And we just wrapped our first season, nine episodes. So Congratulations. Thank you so much. It was a, it was a whirlwind. Tell us a little bit about yourself or any projects you have coming up. <laughs> well, you take it. You're better at this than I am. Because <laughs> you can't say it. Yeah, well, well, he can't say it because he's afraid he's going to put... So we're all from a show called Charles in Charge that was on uh, throughout the 80s. It was quite popular. Yes, I've seen it. And so we are, we are having our 35th anniversary this year. Which Congratulations. Is, which is why we were invited to come into the, into the uh, parade. And then also, uh, we are at the moment working on putting together a reboot for Charles in Charge and all the Charles in Charge fans. Wow, how Scott exciting! Can't say it. He can't say it. We did two specials that are, um, that aired on Nickelodeon a while back, and now they're on our YouTube channel. And I'm doing a third special right now. And um, we also launched the Boo Crew Live, which is the concert with all of the characters that just walked past here telling a story and teaching kids a life lesson, a very valuable life lesson. It's called Just Be You is the theme. And it teaches kids self-esteem 
because a lot of times the kids go back to school, they're often challenged with the idea of, uh, you know, how should I act in order to fit in with the cool kids. Right. And this teaches you, don't worry about trying to fit in with the cool kids, just be yourself and the right people will love you for who you are. And that's a lesson I had to learn too as a young boy growing up, so I wanted to give that back. Uh, we will be in the parade. Uh, we're with Military Makeover with Montel Williams, and we all either have some kind of ties with the military, a veteran, myself, family of veterans, and we give back to the veteran community and their family. So we're just happy to be here and give back like we always do and be a part of this. Well, I just released the deluxe Christmas album uh, a couple weeks ago, but I'll release some more pop music the beginning of next year. So I'm excited to share that with everybody. Is this your first time at the Christmas Parade? It's my first time in the Christmas Parade. Um, it's, it's kind of a full circle for me. When I, when I first moved to Los Angeles to be an actor, I lived a half a block down on this very street in a really cheap single apartment in the ugliest building in Los Angeles. That's all I could afford. And I walked out Sunday morning after Thanksgiving and all the cars were gone. Everything had been towed. And I, I said to this cop, they said, What's going on? What happened? I, my, my car wasn't towed. What's happening here? And he says, What do you live under a rock? It's a Hollywood Christmas parade tonight, <laughs> right down there. And I, I said, Really? Tonight? And so I walked down, and that was my first Hollywood Christmas parade. That is now, an amazing story. All these years later, I've been asked to, to be in the parade. So it's, a, it's kind of an ambition that's come true. And I know you're so busy, but I'm so happy that you were able to make it out today. Well, thank you. You know, the elves, you know, they like it when Santa gets out of the way. You know, the boss, they like it when the boss isn't around, they can get more done. They, they, at least they tell me that. I could just imagine. Well, thank you for everything that you do for the kids.